But with me, a Chanda and the SAA, I'll show you how easy watercolour painting really is. I'm here on a Chanda because I want to show you my watercolour painting techniques and I want to get you over that white paper fear and get you started and develop your watercolour painting. So whether you're a beginner or an advanced artist, I've got some fantastic watercolour techniques that will get you started and take you even further on your watercolour journey. So join me, Matthew Palmer, for my shows on a Chanda. Exciting news! For the fifth year in a row, Hochanda has been awarded the top accolade of Platinum Trusted Service Award from FIFO. These awards recognise businesses that deliver exceptional experiences as rated by you, our customers, and we're honoured to have been selected. The Trusted Service Award means you can shop with confidence based on the reviews from over 60,000 Hochanda customer experiences. Thank you for your independent reviews. It means a lot to us. Hi, I'm Nikki Hassan. I've been working with Heartfelt Creations for about nine years now. Heartfelt Creations as a company launched the company back in 1994. They have been in the industry for a very, very long time. They are crafters, so they know what you crafters want and they listen to us crafters too. Their products range from stamps that coordinate with dyes that then coordinate with a paper pad. But then we also have storage folders, we have decorative dies, we have colouring daubers, we have Insta albums. One of the products that really make Heartfelt unique are their flower shaping moulds, where you can make easy, quick, three-dimensional flowers, which are absolutely stunning. So I hope you can join Heartfelt Creations here on Achanda. Did you know you can continue watching Hochanda 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, for free, using your smart TV? It's just like watching us on your computer or tablet, only now we'll be on your large screen smart TV. Follow these easy steps to get your smart TV set up. Firstly, make sure your smart TV is connected to the internet, either through a wireless connection, if your TV supports it, or via the Ethernet port on the back of your TV. If you're not already connected, use your remote control and select network settings through your TV's menu and follow the instructions to set this up. Remember to have your router's password to hand, whether you're using a wired or wireless connection. This should be on the side or bottom of your router. You can always refer to your TV's help menu or instruction booklet for more information. Once you are set up, press the Smart Hub dedicated button on your remote. This will vary between brands, but it's usually located at the centre of the remote. This is where you'll find your internet web browser app. Select this to open and then type hochanda.com into the search bar. And this will take you to our website homepage, which includes our live broadcast and access to previous shows. So now you can watch, purchase and catch up with your favourite shows 24 hours a day, 7 days a week on your TV, whenever you feel crafty. Hello, very good evening to you and you join me for the second of two shows today with the lovely Karen Anstam. Pendus. Good evening, my darling. Good evening. How are you? Oh, I'm very, you're very bright and bushy tail for seven o'clock in the evening, my darling. Oh, um, what are you taking? <laughs> <laughs> do you really some. want? Do you want to list? <laughs> <laughs> what What time are you with us early with Alex? Three o'clock. Three o'clock. Very busy. Yes, it was extremely busy. Well, we're hoping for another gorgeous hour with you now. We are. Yes. Unfortunately, we're not being able to bring the set back. Right. We've cleared Stampenders out. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> so That's why you've got to get an go. early. Got to get an early. But we yeah. still have a fantastic collection. We've got some beautiful house yeah. masks, some beautiful Stampenders stamps. 90% uh, of them are deeply etched rubber Great. and really, really very fine, intricate details. Fantastic. We'll have a look at those. And I've also, just to mention, the happy hour deal, which is uh, for this hour and this hour only, so 8 o'clock, you know, we won't have this fantastic saving. It is the Hollyhocks stamp, so Impression Obsession. It's 9 .99. It is a big red rubber foam mounted stamp there. Three pounds saving there, a lovely happy hour deal, and as you can see, stamps. Beautiful. 
beautifully. So just to flag that one up for this hour until 8 o'clock, 274424. So let's start with our house mouse. Yes, fantastic. Uh, well, it's, it's, it's a signature, isn't it, of, of Sam Pendus, our lovely, lovely mousy. And here is our cookie sprinkles. Ah, oh, I love the names. Amanda and Mud Pie. Are you two? Nice yes, I've, uh, I've put the names on them so you can see clearly who they are. But oh. uh, it's... I would say it's iconic within the stamping world. Yes. Makes the, the collectibles. It's their signature, isn't their it? Their signature, fantastic. yeah, definitely. And they're, they're like those little piggies that you used to collect. You, a lot of people collect them. And with them being such beautiful stamps, you can do a lot to them Yay. to decorate them up. But as you can see from... Uh, you can colour them in and everything else. But as you can see from some of the samples, if you just do them all in one colour, it, they're still as beautiful <laughs> in one colour as they are fully coloured up. They are, they're so characterful. And I've got to say, for our cookie sprinkles, three quarters of the stock has gone for our beautiful mud pie and Amanda. So, 9 799 Yeah, it is the signature, isn't it? It's like the little wooden mouse of that, uh, that lovely uh, man who carves wood. He always leaves a little wooden mouse on the end of his designs. Do you know who they are? I can't think of his name. It to be somebody brilliant out there will tell me. His, his signature is to carve a little wooden mouse into... The, it could be a seat that he's designed or a bookcase or... So he's a, a wood carver. Yes, and he yes, not a stamper, yeah. yeah and, and his, his signature little... is to carve a little wooden mouse. He was, I can't remember what it's called. Somebody, well, it's somebody right. out there I will be going. I'll be going on that search engine to find <laughs> out because I find that fascinating. So that's the signature. It so is that's the why signature. You're, you think of and... these mice... As and House Penders. Mouse is the signature. As, as I was saying to Alex earlier, they've been going since Jacob were little and they're oh. absolutely gorgeous. Oh, we think we've got the name Mouse Man. What's he called? Mouse Man? Robert Thompson. Robert, Robert Thompson. Thompson. I've seen some of his work when I've been around buildings and things. I from will Yorkshire. be going and yes, looking the mouse at man, that. I call him. Yes. Anyway, we digress. I'm sorry, it was the mice. Uh, so this is our next stamp. This is Marshmallow Munching. Oh, look at the fun they are having. Oh, so we've got Monica, Amanda and friends. Oh, I love the way he's sat on his head while the other one's having a good munch of the marshmallow. Story of my life, <laughs> I, I said earlier, you know, I've, I've had to go brilliant. through life standing on people's heads to reach, reach to kitchen cupboards. We were 15, before, Jacob were 15 before we got anything in our top kitchen cupboard because nobody were tall enough to put them in until he got to 15. That's and then hilarious. when he wants to play games with me, he pushes them all to the back. That's hilarious. That's so funny. Beautiful. 999-045-829. Three quarters of the stock has gone on the marshmallow munching cling stamp there. Uh, we have got Get Well Soon. Oh, this little poor wee fella. Oh, look at the little... Look at the feet upwards. He's, he's having... He's, oh... Thinking of you, it's the expression, the sorrowful expression on his face. It does look feel doesn't sorry for just? himself, doesn't it? Oh. And can't you relate to that when you're in bed feeling Completely. sorry for yourself? Ooh. Completely. <laughs> well, look at him. This one's made by Carolyn. Isn't that gorgeous? I love the stitching there around the outside. Isn't that beautiful? She's done. A, she's done a They've all done a marvelous job, Fiona. All the team. Haven't they just? Oh, I love that with the paper there. Uh, now this sold out earlier. We're on extended delivery, 6th of March. There we go, 6th of March will be the dispatch date, 999. Extended delivery there for our Get Well Mousy stamp there, 502567. And half the stock of the extended is already gone. Uh, next up, more house mouse. Happy birthday, a watercolour wish. Oh, look at these two. Up to, up to no good there, Amanda and Muzzy, is it? Ah, oh, happy birthday. Beautiful. Is that into them <laughs> well, that's gorgeous i love that with the paint splats and the brushes there that's that's fabulous you could have a lot of fun with that on how the happy birthdays turned out 999-558-373 the detail on the stamps are beautiful karen yeah they've they're got so all the beautiful. pointillism into them so that yes, if you're not yes. an exceptional colorer it's showing you where to shade where to make it darker and uh, they've, they've always been, they've, oh, it's a signature thing that they do with all that pointillism and showing you where you can make it darker. Yeah. So it, it, it takes you from beginners right up to people who will do even more with them. But 
you just can't, I don't think you can go That's wrong. That's fantastic because it gives you the shape of the body, the 3D elements Every, and yeah. Yes, yeah, it's fantastic. all all involved in the artwork, definitely. Oh, that's lovely, that is. So there are our lovely mices there, 558373. So please don't miss out on them, they're proving very, very popular. Now we've got the boat docking. Oh, wow. So I'm going to show you the stamp in the black and white that Karen's done for me here. Um, again, lots of de Now this could be used for so many different um segues in terms of designs in terms of ideas in terms of holidays um going on journeys new just you want to get away thinking of you mail cars have, people, a, have a great holiday yeah. be safe yes yeah Look at definitely that that looks and amazing is, and that's again is the is the detail with the rubber that you get that you can uh, find and boss it that is gorgeous. Look, it looks like a brass plate. <laughs> it does, doesn't it? Yeah. It really does, like Both etching men brass. and female cards, and look yes. how that one's been put away. It's got a, a um, craft treat uh, stencil behind it, but that's <gasps> going in grants into the to the journey. Yeah. That's fantastic. And again, we were saying, you know, for what, whoever in the family, now is the time. The time is now, you see, so many dis... Oh, look at this, I do. Happy this retirement. Something. Happy retirement, yes. Isn't that gorgeous? I love this. Oh, something about this boat in that embossing is just spectacular. And you can keep it really simple and just do that colouring in. Fabulous. Look at this stormy. It may be stormy weather's now, but you'll weather the storm, whatever the sentiment. That's it. Yeah, Fabulous. definitely. Definitely. Both Nine male and female, it's not, it's not, uh, gen it's generic all the way around, I would think. Gorgeous. All the better for it, I say. Uh, 999 Now, favourite of mine is the background music stamp. Look at this. Is it as big as this, Karen? What a that is, the, that is the stamp, yeah, that's the, the size. It's, wow. it's an A6 stamp. However, it looks like a complete sheet of music. It one, is. One page. And instead of... I've seen sheet, mu uh, sheet stamps, music stamps, and they've been bigger. This one is all compact. And um, I'm waiting for you to hum it because you, well, you, was, you, was, you were going I to it. I was reading it. I said there's three flats there. Um, and you can actually read every single note. I'm not sure what, well, you know, which, which, which instrument it's for. But uh, that is amazing. Isn't that beautiful? It's fantastic we'll it detail. It for so, it? And, it, and it's, so, it's so tiny. So it'll be proportionate for some of your other stamps. You know, like you're all and create with the little people. It'll be proportionate for all those. It's not out proportionate for, for anything. It's absolutely gorgeous. I can, you can read every single note. You've got forte there, loud, piano, softly. It's, it's just amazing. That's my favourite stamp. That is just amazing. Please don't miss out on it. 999 Half the stock has gone. That's phenomenal detail. Love that. Next up, we've got our beautiful painted lady. What a pretty butterfly. Again, another big stamp. And a beautiful stamp. But don't forget, you can cut that down. So Ooh, you yes. can just do the butterfly and cut that down. Great idea. And then half a flower. You could put half the flowers around the sides. You don't have to have full flowers. But yeah, it, um, oh, there we go. All cut out and decoupage, yes, decoupage. Still absolutely beautiful. Love that idea. Just a, yeah, a with focal a... point on its own with a, a nice, simple, simple background, but absolutely beautiful. Isn't that gorgeous? And I, do you know what? I love the simplicity of this that you've done with the masking. Um, Caroline, again. Isn't that lovely? Done amazing. The They've done amazing, haven't they? Yeah. So stylish. So you can colour it, you can heat emboss yeah. it, you can just do it in black and white, you can do your pencil shading onto it. You've got your lines in there that's showing all your shading as well. Beautiful. 999 you painted lady. We're moving on to the Peony Miracle now. Um, so three separate stamps there. So great value. We've got our butterfly separate to our lovely peony. And then even miracles take a little time. We've got a lovely sentiment there. A lovely sentiment. Nice for a corner, uh, uh, the, for the stamp to go into the corner. Uh, or, build, or scene build, go around, make a full wreath with it. But you colour it whatever colour you want. A wow. pin is whatever you, a flower is whatever colours you want, isn't it? Love that with the butterfly landing on the pin. Yeah, definitely. And again, totally different sort of uh, thinking there again. Just the butterfly and our beautiful paper there. Isn't that gorgeous? Nine ninety nine for our peony miracle trio there. Five six five two zero seven. Okie dokie. Ah, rose teacup. Courage, joy, a cup of for a friend. Courage, love. 
Ah, a lot of nice words there. Yeah. You know, you have a lot. You can have a lot of sentiments coming out of your cup. Uh, I've just done a couple in the interval, uh, quick, quick uh, little samples. Yeah. But also the little jar of flowers. I'm going to hold. See yes. that they've been made and decoupaged by our Sam from there oh. but don't forget that's one that you build up you build up your own scene you can have one one flower coming out of it you can have uh, have masked it there and and uh, built up but don't forget you can mask it you don't don't have to mask up all the you don't have to cut a mask out for all the leaves yeah. i only did the main really flowers good. but envelopes yeah and, and that's said. absolutely gorgeous so she stamped <laughs> on the on the tissue paper and done, done it onto it a, a jar but then the flowers actually popped into it she's die cut the uh, not die cut them she's fussy cut them and added them oh, onto stems yes, so you couldn't even tell that that would be from no. a stamp Isn't that amazing that is 14.99 for your rose teacup set six eight three four two six lovely ideas there karen um oh the field of flowers now we can create a really fa fabulous story with this one because we've got an incredible set of vistas here this is as varied as your imagination because Ooh. they are clear stamps you can see exactly where they where you want to stamp them where to line them up um the green room that i'm actually in has got a, a painting on the wall that reminds me exactly of that it's exactly those uh, and it's lavender so you can make them into lavenders but it's, there are a lot of stamps in there and you yeah. can make the scene as big or as little or as focused or, you know, in perspective as you, as you yeah. wish. But uh, ideal for journals, ideal for making big cards, ideal for whatever you want to do. But Love just a, a vast array of stamps that you can completely add up, add up together. Sam's done that one. Isn't that lovely? And then we can use it for the new home here that again that Sam has used. Isn't that beautiful? Again, just that repetition. Another one of Sam's there. You can just see how different. Again, and then again, just a happy birthday to you, just using the flowers. Yeah, just so using the flowers, definitely. She's done a marvellous job uh, popping those together. And, you know, the, the time's limited, but she's done amazing by popping them all. And, and they're all different. They all are. All different. It's not Fantastic. Thing, you, never have to make, you can use one stamp set, as many cards as you want, but you never have to do them the same. Absolutely. 14.99517461. Then we've got the bullet journal. Oh, this is great for your journaling. This is great for journaling, ah. but I was also using it on uh, uh, on my very first demo at three o'clock. And it's if you look into it there, you've got little love arts, and they're all very tiny, <laughs> nice little fillers that you can use around. But they've got your bullet points, so it's not just for journaling. It's to to um, because we're quite. We're, the, the 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 norm now is to build up build up backgrounds and yes. and with shapes yes. and they're just exactly your shapes to be able to do it. Love them! What a great fun! And there they are in the colourway. And can you see the little frame there with the yes. house and the heart? If you look on one of the house mouse ones that C Carolyn's oh. done, yeah, um, it's it's up here. It's the grey one that where she was poorly. Oh, and, right, yeah, uh, just right far up here. When you come back, oh, up, when I come up, and yeah. you can see that she's used that as a frame. Oh yes, as in I the, can see it in the mice's. Here it is. Yeah, a little frame. There we so go. So that shows how vert versatile it can be. She's used it as a yeah. as frames for the house. I think that's an excellent idea. Just keep Fun. moving it on. Yeah. Fantastic. 14.99.040.555. So, coming to the last two stamps, a couple of stamps here, uh, Karen. We've got uh, birthday wishes, so lots of fantastic birthday sentiments there. Hope your birthday is filled with lots of fam friends, family, food and fun. Birthday, we've got the definitive uh, meaning of it. Instead of being late to wish you a happy birthday, can I be considered early for next year? <laughs> so it's got the latest birthday, it's got everyone that you, you know. Um, what do you do? If you send them late, you've got, you've got one there. We've got a few samples with just the, just the words on to them. Just there, our Sam's done them. Fantastic. 1499 2746 uh, And moving on to our dog kisses. Life is rough, hug a friend. You had me at woof. Who needs a hug and a great big kiss? Faithful, loyal friend forever. So a set of 12 stamps here. 1499 days. These are great. So characterful. 
Yes, yeah, just 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 the the dog's head, so you can have them popping out of windows <laughs> or at win inside in the window like, frames. Of the page. Yeah, out of the side of the page or whatever top, you want. You know, top nice. of a bookmark, out of the book. And, out of yeah. the book, top of a bookmark, yeah. Even down, if you look at the two samples in front of it, you can see oh, that yes, doggy, doggy treats, treats has been used. So it's nice to make uh, make the headers for doggy treats. Lovely. And, uh, you know, Christmas, make your own doggy treats. For, not your own doggy treats, but bag your own doggy treats up. I and then this. that one's got them all this on is great. with the, the paw prints. on. There's plenty more into there, but absolutely. Oh, they're great. Colour them with the colours of your 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 oh, own doggy. pets. Fourteen ninety nine five one eight two seven one. I'm gonna get to my last one then, Karen. Uh, simply because we want to get to you, my darling. And uh, this is our mirror stamping plate. Oh, well, I was just talking to Karen about this. I love this. Saw this in action at the end of the last show with um, lovely Alex there. Fourteen ninety nine. So if you want a mirror image, reversible. And you're thinking, oh, 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 I'm, I'm a bit stuck. Uh, then this is perfect. 912516 to get that alter lefty and righty if you've just got the one stamp. Let's have a look at the website because you can shop by brand, of course. And, there's any, and don't forget our happy hour deal as well, just for this hour only, is that lovely um, Hollyhocks stamp there from Serendipity. And you're saving three pounds. Oh, don't miss out on that music cling stamp for 9.99. It is phenomenal. The Mices are doing very, very well as well. Uh, so please don't miss out. Shop ahead by Stamp Hunters on the web as well. I know a lot sold out earlier, so we'll see what there is. And let our lovely Karen show lovely. us what to do. So all I'm going to use is a stencil, some inks, a little bit of tape, one ink pad, and a pen. And I'm going to do a. a, a a card straight onto onto the onto the card. I have got my ink somewhere. I've got orange, green, and yellow. I'm going to change that green up, and we're going to have a little bit of a, a brighter green. So I thought I'd do a house mouse one, Fiona. Ah. Is there any particular one that you would like to see? Are you sure you don't want to use that music stamp because it is rather spectacular? No, just, I, just me, is it? I will uh, do the music. I'll, I'll eat and boss the music stamp for you. I promise. I'll eat and boss it. Which one? Oh, I. Are we, we, oh, they're all gorgeous. Which one do you want, Emily? Any? Uh, uh, let's have... Uh, oh, I do like the cookies, Amanda and Mud Pie. Cookie sprinkles, please. Cookie sprinkles. We'll go cookie sprinkles. It's the way he's squeezing that icing out of that tube have with you, the, you, all his you, might. You know that you've done that yourself yeah, as well. Yeah, because I have. Of course and I you know when cast. you get them spray creams? like them spray creeps oh. so i've got a, a six by six card and this is uh, just my last stencil that's been cut so it's got like a frame and then let's get the tape which i've lost the end of which is normal isn't it oh found it i think i have yeah so I'm doing it using low tack tape. I don't, obviously don't want to to damage my, my card stock, and I'm just taking the tack away. I know with the low tack tape you don't have to. Yeah. However, I'm, it's always better to be safe than sorry, mm -hmm. because I'm going to be I'm going to be stamping in that. Now I'm not actually worried where I'm stamping at the moment. I'm just going to put a small amount of of colour onto it, and this is. Uh, this is quite difficult for me because I'm really, really heavy-handed and I'm going to try and be very, very soft with it. I don't want to put too much on, so I'm just using three colours and bobbing it all onto the cardstock. And I'm probably not being hard enough, but I do find that I, I am far too heavy-handed with ink. So I've got three colours and I'm going to do two of each. So I'm still do working in the threes. Yeah. But I'm going to do it with with two two of each. And then we'll do look look at that dirty hands already. We'll do a little bit there. And I think I've done it onto the back of the card and not the front of the card. And then we'll get a little bit of orange. And while the stencil is sit still down we'll get that blended in mm. with it being a we'll just blend that one in see if we can get rid of that dirty mark however i'm not so worried because it's just a it's just a background that's going to focal in onto what i want to oh, what i want to show and then i'm just going to clean my hands off and dry them 
on the back of your yeah, like you normally do on the back of your trousers. Down the clothes, yeah. Down your clothes. So while that's still in place, I've got a black liner pen, mm -hmm. and I'm just going to go around the inside. And I would do. And uh, guess what? We're live on TV, so it all goes wrong. And I've gone under the under the line, so my heart's not going to be absolutely perfect there. Not worried. There's no point getting upset about things like that. You can always rectify it. And if it doesn't rectify, you just use another piece of cardstock. And take that off. And then oh, we've got... Absolutely fine. It makes Perfect. just a nice little... And do you know what? I've done that totally wrong. Oh, well, I didn't know. You didn't have to tell me. I was oh, well, going yeah, yeah. And do you know what I've done wrong? No, what was that <laughs> I now? should have stamped before I did the, the drawing. <laughs> oh. You'll see in a minute. Oh. But I've got it, I've got one that I've done earlier, yeah. Oh wow! Well. Yeah, totally got carried away with the, <laughs> in the mood of the moment. Get some VersaClaire and just show you how nice this stamps. I'm not even going to colour this in at all because it'll just it, it's just a beautiful image on its own. Amanda and mud pie, this one is. Amanda and mud pie, and I'm just gonna pop there, and you can see because it's so deeply etched and it's so well cushioned mm -hmm. i'm uh, i'm not even using anything underneath it at all at this on this particular occasion so then we'll take that off and you can see that that as stamped there but i will bring the other one in to show you my terrible terrible so you mistake. had wanted the sides to disappear behind you it. wanted the sides to uh, disappear oh, around see, uh... it yes yeah, so the heart that I've done. Oh, I, yes, I understand. Yeah, yeah I uh, I should have done it. So we'll hide that. No, we'll hide that one. And then this is the one that we've just...